It's the 28th. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Is it still morning? It is still morning. It is still morning. We've been very busy doing nothing. Well, Lee's been sorting out insurance for your car, haven't you? Because it's the renewal, yeah. goes up every year. We were just discussing that gone are the days when you used to look forward to the price going down in your car insurance. Now it seems that your car insurance is just doesn't go up by quite as much each year. Anyway, we've been doing that. Um, I'm going to be playing Animal Crossing on my thing 2DS. they bought me, 2DS. You're playing... Lego Star Wars Force Awakens. Lego Star Wars Force Awakens. Kenzie is still poorly. Um, he's been testing for COVID, but he's been testing negative. But I think it's flu. He's like in bed. He's been in bed since Boxing Day. He's got temperature of high 38 to mid 39s. Um, he's on cold and flu tablets. He's got a real chesty cough. He's not really hungry. He's cold. He's not well, bless him. But my sister Jackie's just sent us all a picture of a positive COVID test. So I'm going to look forward to that little bombshell dropping in the new year, I think. Don't know what's the what's the uh, incubation time these days. Five days, wasn't it? Five days. So it might just be ready for going back to work. Mm, sorry, Emma. Um, yeah, hopefully we'll avoid it. But I don't take the vaccines anymore. So um, we'll see what happens. Anyway, I'm going to sit drinking a can of Coke and doing this. I just thought I was recording and I wasn't. I just did a cool thing. I just, my little person you can see has got a swollen face and that is because she got stung by a bee. So what you do is you shake the tree and things fall out of it. But I managed to catch the bee. Oh, there's some money. That's fallen out of the tree. So this is where you can get goodies and things to decorate your home with. Oh, there's a hole there. So I'm going to... I'm sure loads of people know this game already because it's a very old game. What year would you say this is, Lee? Ten years. About ago. ten years old. Um, but it's an updated version of the game I've got. I can sell all of these things in the shop. So I'm just swapping that net for... Oh, I'm stood on... There's Kenzie coughing in the background. Poor thing. He's just had a shower and got changed into his new pyjamas. So I've got a fossil. I can take that to the guy at the museum. Get the fossil appraised. Um, but, yeah, I was feeling really impressed with myself because Kenzie told me to try catching... Um, when the bees come out of the trees, to try catching a bee in the net rather than me getting stung. And I did. I managed to catch a bee, which was really clever. Um, I'm going to go down onto the beach and find more things to collect that I can go and sell for more money. Um, I'm I'm the mayor of this town. I don't know if I'm doing a particularly good mayoral job here. I think I'm going to be full in a minute. My bag will be full. Now I'll have to go and sell stuff. Let's have a look. Yep, I'm going to go and take that to uh, be appraised at the museum. Anyway, that's what I'm doing with my time. It's two o'clock. I finished playing my game for a bit. I've had a bit of a tidy up, sorted out some of the Christmas gifts into one big box at the moment because uh, I'm not sorting things out properly. Um, I've put away some of the stuff that I bought, like the bath bits I bought from TK Maxx yesterday when we went shopping for Lee's birthday. I have brought various um, cruelty-free vegan I think they are Bayless and Harding. Uh, yes, it's this brand. Various bits of this. I bought this, which is a hand wash for the bathroom. And then I got a huge, great big body wash and some bubble bath. I'm going to have a very quick shower, put my new pyjamas on that I also bought from TK Maxx. And then I'm going to go downstairs, have some leftover Christmas dinner because it needs eating today. And make a start on a Christmas puzzle. We've heated up the leftovers got cold meat and we had leftover gravy and what have you so it's like christmas dinner part two with slightly less stuff but it doesn't look like there's slightly less stuff but there is and kenzie is not well enough to eat anything bless him three o'clock i am stuffed lee is stuffed very full unfortunately kenzie's just not up for food right now bless him um i've brought this down from the loft and i've brought the mat in from the other room. We washed up dishes, got the dishwasher on, and I'm gonna sit and puzzle to my heart's content while watching true crime, because that's what I do. 
I've managed to do most of the outside, but as is always the case, and I don't think I've ever done a puzzle and not had this situation, I haven't picked up a couple of pieces. There's one down here, one down here. So I think I've got four pieces missing on the edge, which will be in this box here somewhere, hopefully. It was a second-hand puzzle, so I'm hoping they are in there somewhere. Um, and it's usually just because I have not sorted them correctly, I do it a bit quick and not very thorough. Okay, let's crack on, shall we? Oh, I didn't know we were due snow, Lee. That's because I gave them back this toy, wasn't it? And they found the hole again. Yeah. Their birthday toy. Oh, well. Oh, it snowed in the bedroom as well, yeah. did it? Is it a localised snowstorm? A blizzard. A localised blizzard. Oh, well, they're having a, having a good time. Boys, what have you done? It's half eleven and my phone died, so I've barely filmed anything else since uh, I was doing the puzzle. I've done quite a bit of the puzzle, but I'm not going to go down now and show you it. I'll show you it in the morning. I'm going to make this a two-day vlog. <sighs> Excuse me. Because it's getting late and I'm feeling a little bit sleepy now. I've been doing um, another course. Um, I've decided... I've been thinking about it for quite a while. I've decided to just bite the bullet and do it now to get Reiki as a skill in my skill set. Um, it's something I've been looking into, thinking about for a few years and then not actually doing anything about. And I just feel like now is the time. Like I'm being very much drawn to doing it now. So I'm doing my level one and two in that. It will give me additional strings to my bow something else I can look at doing around work, uh, my day job, and hopefully will also be beneficial to people within my family. And it's also something that I can use on the animals that I look after. So um, yeah, that's what I'm doing at the moment. I'm working my way through the course. Um, I need to book an attunement session for my first attunement with a Reiki master um which i have paid for and i'm just waiting for him to contact me um that's through the course that i'm doing and then i'll need to book a second one further on in the course for my second attunement and yeah hopefully it'll all go well and i'll be able to do this they do say anyone can do it if you you know are open to it so we'll see how it goes anyway I'll come back to you tomorrow. Um, we're going to go and see Lee's mum, pop to a pet shop to get a new bulb for Nagini's tank because it's gone all flickery. Um, and hopefully Kenzie will be feeling a bit better. His temperature is by, right back up to 39.9 again. He's literally been in bed for two days. He tried very, very hard to get up and play on his computer. And within 20 minutes, he was back in bed again. So... That means he's very poorly, bless him. And that's whilst he's on medication. I'll see you in the morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning, you lovely lot. It is 10 o'clock on, what is the day? On one of these blurry days between Christmas and New Year. Friday, it's Friday. Um, let me show you my puzzle. That is what I was working on yesterday evening. And that is what I will be working on again when I get in later on. We're going off to see Lee's mum and to bring her her present. And, um, yeah, then I'll come back and relax with my puzzle after a nice bath. Kenzie is unfortunately still unwell. Temperature of 38.5 going up to 39.9, bless him. That's with medication. Um, you can tell he's definitely poorly because he's been in bed the entire time. Every time he stands up, he gets very dizzy and comes out for a few minutes and then goes back into his bed again. He's on and out of, in and out of sleep. Um, and yeah, he tried to play his computer game, tried to turn his computer on, felt ill, so went back to bed after 20 minutes. That never happens. So I'm keeping an eye. And I think if we have another day of high temperature, I will contact 111 maybe and just see what they suggest. I, I suspect it's flu of some sort, but yeah, he's, he's not well, bless him. We are on the way to visit Lee's mum. Um, 
and the weather's pretty diabolical. Very, very wet, very, very windy, rather chilly, not pleasant. Lots of standing water, big puddles. It would seem that Abingdon has sunshine, which uh, we don't have that where we are. We've literally driven out of the rainstorm under a beautiful rainbow and in to Abingdon, which is beautiful blue sun. We've been over to Lee's mum's, done Prezi exchanging, drunk tea, eaten biscuits. We're now going to Pets at Home to get a bowl for the snake tank. I have bought the bowl, but now I'm over to B&M, which is where Lee is waiting for me. I need bleach, and there was some other stuff, but I can't remember what it was. I need mealworms. Mealworms for, that's 4 99 for a big tub, uh, 400 grams. So it's a fiver for 400 grams, or a fiver for 400 grams. I'll go for the bag, I think. There for the geese. Hmm. I might try those. Harming. Let's see if this is link proof, shall we? One for Link and one for Timmy. Now this is what I was looking for for Salem to replace the robin that she used to have in the dogs ate. I'm going to get that one, I think. She's got a real... Th I mean, to be honest, she goes for the real things, doesn't she? This is probably only going to encourage that. But it is a toy that she will play with. £3.50. Oh, no. £2.50. Oh, it's like a little uh, hex bug, but it's a mouse. Now for a couple of bits at Lidl. I'm the fire starter, twisted fire starter. It's three o'clock. Brendan's just run over to Costa to use the toilet. Leah's just putting the trolley back. I've spent about £89 on a small shop, but you know, just topping up with bread and I needed bleach and dishwasher tablets and that kind of thing. It's half past four, but out there it looks to be about nine o'clock at night. It's so dark and dingy. It's chucking it down with rain again. I've just come back from walking the dogs. Uh, we are, let me show you what we're cooking. That is the big giant hog roast sausage roll. So we can heat that up for half an hour. And then we're having uh, potato salad, bits of salad, picky bits to go with it. Did I show you where I'd got to on my puzzle? I don't think I did this morning. This is the puzzle. Christmas scene. And... It's, it's a matte finish, which sort of has a bit of glare on it. And I'm wondering if it's the same situation that um, Imo has with her puzzle at the moment. Especially when the light is directly above. It's almost like I need a side light coming in. I am going to make tea for us. Brendan's now gone home. And because we picked him up and took him with us to see Lee's mum. I'm going to make three teas and take one up to Kenzie. I've called him in sick because his temperature's still just under... 40 degrees so there's no way he's going to be well enough for work tomorrow six o'clock i'm all showered lee actually brought me my food to the bath it was very luxurious i was laying in the bath eating my food um it's probably not the most hygienic of things but it was very lovely and i didn't have to get up and then go and sort it all out so i've now got out of the bath and i've sorted my hair out we're going to watch the christmas ghosts episode which we haven't yet seen and we're going to watch the latest episode of reacher and then i'm going to go downstairs make a cup of tea and do some more of my Christmas puzzle. It's 11 o'clock and I've done that much of my puzzle. I have a feeling this piece is missing because it should have a lot of green on it and I can't find a piece that looks like it should fit there, which is a bit frustrating. Um, and then I have to start on the fiddly bits like the hills over here the roofs which are white so they're going to be difficult oh there's a bit of sleigh there let's attach that there um and then the general snowy bits with the footprints and what have you down here 
which are just there. I've done all the obvious bits. I cannot understand people who literally sort of do it like a printer, <laughs> do that and look for a specific piece. And maybe that's why I do it quicker because I don't do it that way. I pick out obvious parts and go for the most obvious and then I start laying pieces out. So I'm like, oh, that's roughly here in the picture and that's roughly there. And then I, they start to all join up after, you know, I've done that a few times. This bit is confusing me. It looks like it should be part of a lantern. But I can't see a lantern that's missing. Missing a bit. <laughs> that makes sense. We've got the two lanterns here. We've got this lantern up here. We've got those lanterns. I'm just not seeing, oh, hold on, uh, no, and it's got tree on it. Oh, I can see where it is. It's up right up here. I think that's the lantern, which is, yeah, it's right up there somewhere, isn't it? It's just next to these houses. Uh, sorry, there's hissing and all sorts going on under the table. <laughs> so it goes that way round, then that must go right. Yeah, that goes on there. Right, okay, I've found it now. What's going on? Why is there hissing going on? I've taken your food away, love. Well, actually, there was no food. I've literally taken your bowl. Look, here's your, here's your bird. What's this? What's that? What's that? No. You two can stop looking all interested at her. Right, let's get this tea made. And I'm going to say my good nights to you all because it is nearly 11 o'clock. So I'm going to have this cup of tea and snuggle down in bed and warm up. Oh, excuse me. I'm really quite sleepy. I've only got another few days off work. Kenzie is not working tomorrow, so I don't have to get up at the crack of dawn. But I do need to go out at some point because I'm on sheep duty. So uh, the boys can come up the yard with me. And I haven't seen the sheep um, over Christmas, so I want to go and see them last year i was up there in the stable with them when they were little and you know it was merry christmas it was just maggie and um autumn but this year there are many more sheep and they're all out in the field so um yeah and the goats of course so i want to go and see them um anyway i'll see you in the morning